You know, I've been uh, impressed with uh, the rebuilding attempt here to have three freshmen on your starting lineup. Sven drips a three in. The Riverhawks are running a zone defense here, really trying to just take up space, make the catch shoot from outside. Carly Pogue rattles in an 18-footer. She just checked in as well with Peyton Booth. She Healy, yes. Great head fake by Rudolph, the runner just off the right side, and the rebound to Peyton Booth. Tremendous box out by Peyton Booth to be especially aware. Oh. In stride, it's Kat Fogarty right back up the floor, down to eight. And then Lai falls down, another great steal by Hendrick, lobs ahead to Sven, throws it up and lays it in. Down there in the baseline to be able to finish that play. Again, this is the type of momentum, type of plays the Wildcats need. Lopez kicks out, Hendrick, 4-3. Katie McKee, another freshman who checks in. Seven total freshmen for Lowell. Healy gives UNH its first three of the afternoon. And really the first time the Wildcats regained the lead. That's right, first lead for New Hampshire today. Lopez open on the swing. Yes, a response. And the Riverhawks again going back to a 2-3 zone look. They keep mixing up on the Wildcats, keep them on their toes, not let them get comfortable in any offensive scenario. Healy's runner too strong, saves it four seconds. Booth, got it! They've got 17, I'm reading that right, 17 offensive rebounds today. Which is what was needed given uh, the poor performance before Simpson. that. Simpson. Her 81st career three-pointer. To make it, uh, a dent in this lead. Pogue, no look pass. Torres finishes off the dime. Final seconds trickle down. The runner is no good by Sven. New Hampshire defeats UMass Lowell 66-45.